I knew it was not only a fantasy. I knew she really did it. But I didn't say anything to her. Because alcohol. And finally, because I find something interesting to write. I just say, stop. Don't help me anymore. And I had to finish in a few days the episode. So one night, I ask her to help me again. I will never ask you this if I don't have to give the script very soon. Don't worry, baby. I will do it just for you. Tomorrow, hide at Turtle Beach, and you'll get to see what sort of friends that Samantha's husband really has. At the first moment, I did not understand what she means. But day after, when I saw my best friend Marco, my old lover, Gilda, and my wife, then I realized how perfect Shelley Samantha was. The series is still on on TV, and it's very successful. We know that now it's a lady writing the stories. No one has ever seen her. We are talking about Sandra McBenton. Do you know who she is? And why? You stop and disappear at the top of your fame. One day, she make me, me very, very drunk. Hello. Good morning. I'm Mr. Ricardo Belli. May I talk with Mr. Stones? I'm sorry, but he's very busy at the moment. I'm his wife. May I help you? Oh, good morning, Mr. Stones. I'm in town and I'm coming to see your husband. Excuse me, who are you? I'm the assistant of the producer of the TV series Sex Out of the City. Sorry, I didn't know you were coming. My husband, he didn't say anything. You're more than welcome to come round. Uh, do you need the address? Uh, yes, more or less. At the moment, I'm close to the Elville Marché. OK, you're not far at all. All you have to do is go straight down the road and then take the second road on the left and the house is straight off the beach. OK, so down to the beach. OK, I try to be there as soon as possible. Goodbye. Like some coffee? Yeah, but is Italian coffee? Yes, it is. Thank you. Thanks. So now, you know everything? Yeah, but the last time I saw him, he looked fine. My husband is very good at hiding his problems. He is very aggressive, drunk all the time. Anyway, the last episode he wrote, it was excellent. Ricardo, may I call you Ricardo? Yeah, of course. Well, Ricardo, I wrote the last seven episodes. No. Yes. Come with me. I have something to show you. Look, this is episode 97 that I'm writing. This is one of the best I've ever read. Very sexy. I knew Samantha, the audience will love it. Do you think the production will like it? Oh yeah, I'm sure. Sign a new contract. Uh, I 
and maybe you can write uh, the episode for the next two seasons. And if Nicolas is in these conditions, then nothing else I can do. Anyway, you have to talk to the producers. Will you be able to help me, Ricardo? But we have to find a new name for you. We cannot use stones. Of course. So, will you be able to help me? Yeah, but if I help you, what will I get in return? <laughs> I have a little surprise for you in the courtyard. Yeah? Yes, go through. Go on. She was taking my place and she showed me what she was doing. Look at what they're doing. Could be a very good idea for your script. Your best friend Marco and his girlfriend Martina. I'll show you what Samantha would do. What? What do you do? I'm going to show you what Samantha would do. Good for your script. So, now you know who is this Sandra McKenton. Thank you. I'm very sorry. Wait, wait, wait. The story is not finished. Now the most important part comes. You know, for this interview, I can get paid 100,000 euros from any media. Don't you ask me why. I did for you for only $2,000. Because where I will go, I will not need any money. One day, my wife Shelley left me. I was alone. I was drinking every day and living in a very terrible place. Better you go. The police will be here anytime. Thank you, Mr. Stone. Good luck. 